light on my feet. Mm, I want to have a word. Drop your weapons! I'll feed your innards to the ants before I do that, Istik. This is your, your last chance! No, look up. That was your last chance, Istik. Now burn! Wasting time, Beretta. You're not here to play with the locals. Of course, Kithra. We merely sought to. No excuses. Question, kill, then move on. Find the weapon. Our queen watches us. Fail her at your peril. A red dragon. I envy its knight. Would that I rode such a steed. A crash must be near. Come, my kin await. We must speak. Ryder, my time is short. Lead me to... Shh, shh, shh. Such a familiar tone. Were I not merciful, I would slice the skin clean from your meat. Yet you are not bleeding. For I am nothing if not merciful. Your name, child. Lazel. Lazel. Proud. Regal, even. You will call me Gestil Kithrak. Vos, Knight Supreme. The Queen's Silver, the Queen's Sword. I am who you say. A geek vessel has fallen from the sky, Lazel. Thieves aboard have taken a weapon most precious. It is polyhedric in shape and inscribed with the sacred runes of our people. You suddenly feel a strange anxiety take hold. Not your own, but that of the artifact you carry. Somehow, it's afraid you attune your mind to it. The artifact does not want to part from you. It does not want to fall into the Gith Raider's hands. Take word to your crash. You are to join our search. Speak up, child. Affirm your mandate. duty, Kithrak. I shall alert my caretaker with haste. The Kithrak nods, content with Lazel's answer. You serve your queen well, child. Take your slaves and hunt those who escaped the Geich ship. They must carry the weapon. I fly now to Vlakith, our undying queen. She will see your faith rewarded in this plane and ours. A current of deception carries Voss's words. Wherever he flies, it is not to Vlakith. To Danos! To the sky! Damn it! Oh. You did well to intervene. Vexed as I am to admit it, the Gestil Kithrak would have flayed our skin and left our carcasses to burn in the sun. All for the sake of the artifact that we carry. The crash is near, this much we know. We follow the path forward and into the valley. No one, not even the ignoble Gestil Kithrak, will keep me from my purification.
What's in here? is irresistible you recognize the overwhelming authority that you've used on others only infinitely stronger and turned against you your vision clouds leaving you in a dark featureless shadowscape nothingness in every direction then there are three figures before you an armored male elf exuding power and command handsome younger man with a quick easy smile and a pale young woman with even paler eyes these are my chosen they speak for me aid their search for the prison and you will be worthy to stand beside them in my Give me that look. I don't know what just happened any more than you do. We should keep going. The voice is gone. Muted by this... this gith relic. Why does a half-elf carry it? I don't know. Not exactly. All I know is it's important I get it back to Baldur's Gate. At any cost. I suppose if we're to continue together, I may as well tell you. I serve Shah. My home is a secret cloister in Baldur's Gate. A group of us were sent to retrieve the artifact. Now I'm the only one left. I can't afford to fail. I can't tell you anymore. This mission required utmost secrecy. We all submitted to having our memories suppressed so that we couldn't betray Shah's confidence. If I reach my contact in the city, I'll have my memories restored. Until then, I have to guard the artifact with my life. There. You have the truth, for all it's worth. Let's continue. Heavens forbid. We're all entitled to our secrets. There's nothing more I can tell you. All I remember is that I have to get back to my contact in the city. I know those symbols. Githyanki runes. Ancient as Vlacketh herself. You stole that from my people. Yes. And a lot of my people died in the process. I won't fail them. Not after what I saw your kind do to them. A powerful artifact indeed, to have caught the attention of so many. Not least the Absolute itself, the three figures in the vision, the Chosen are searching for it. With the cultists' aid, it will not be long before they find it. 
before they find you. You have evaded them so far, thanks, it seems, to the artifact itself. But how long can such protection last? Shadowheart has made her position clear. She will see that it is taken to its destination at any cost. No doubt the Githyanki will seek to reclaim that which is theirs, and you still do not know what it even is. For now, but any crimes against my kin will be answered for in time. I just saved you. Keep that in mind next time you want to air your grievances. Here goes nothing. been used in a while. That's enough. On your feet. Where are you taking us? If this is about that weapon your friend was talking about, we don't have it and we don't know shit about it. Silence! Move! No. No, 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 I'm not going in there. I won't. Anyone want to join her? As I thought. Through the doors. Now! The captain is expecting you. Forward. Carefully. These cultists have the crash on high alert.
Is the enemy of my enemy my friend? Or do the Gith only have enemies? Time to press ahead. Understand? If I choose to kill you, you will not even Is see it. Is someone crying? I'll give it a shot. Shouldn't have made me your enemy. <laughs> hmm. Within the artifact, a feeling stirs uncertainty. Your curious the blood of Lathanda spilled in holy battle with Samaster. Immortalized here for all to worship. So they can... They're hunting you. They want the artifact. They'll stop at nothing to take it from you. Is it not Vlacketh's command to welcome her faithful? I expected no visitors faithful or otherwise. Why have you come? We seek the Sathisk. Show me the way. You are infected. A geek thrall is something to eradicate, not reason with. The faithful may be purified. This is Vlacketh's protocol. Fine. Let the Gustil carry out your fate. Report to the infirmary at once. And step carefully. Crescia like watches you. I heard they're making us join the patrol soon. The search must be going bad. I'd already disarmed the discipline when you were punished severely in Kadir. Walk freely. This place is as tight as a patriarch's purse. That vessel contains the parasite. You should take it.
Vertical incision from pineal eye to end of notochord. Intestinal coloration consistent with samples 231 to 259. Do you have a question? Or are you just going to stand there gawking? I am a child of Gith, not discarded rat flesh. Am I not due your respect? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Let the istic with you speak. And I will decide what respect you're owed. Lazel, is it? Fine. And be quick. My work is of vital import. We carry gay tadpoles and have done so for countless days. Yet we show no symptoms. We must enter the Zaysk. You are infected, but showing no signs of cerebral impairment. Fascinating. Either your tadpole is special, or you are. We must find out which. Go to the Zaythisk. I will ensure you are cured. The apparatus at the top of those stairs. Quickly, now. Time is of the essence. Even Gith Yankee rarely experiences Aethys. You are very lucky, Istic. The device is strange. Made of taut flesh and pockmarked metal. It waits for something. The Zaythisk. Vlakit's purity distilled. My duty, my right. The device is an ingenious synthesis of illithid anatomy and metal alloys. It hums with psionic energy. Hinting at paths into unknown minds and unseen planes. Stand aside. My time has come. I will not. I gave you my might. You will respect my charge. between confident and arrogant. A beguiling turn of events. Go on, into the Zaythisk. I will follow. The device is strange, made of taut flesh and pockmarked metal. It waits for something. You feel your parasite stir. Do not fear. My experience in operating this machine is unparalleled. There is nothing on any plane stronger than a Zaythis for curing unwanted afflictions. More than ceremorphosis. <laughs> you deny me my due, then seek my comfort. Bah! Sit and be pure! body grows cold, its warmth sapped by the cold metal seat. The machine awakens. You must focus on the parasite at all times. The Zaythisk will do the rest. Layers of magic weave themselves tightly around your head. The tadpole squirms and contracts. It's trying to hide. You realize the device is hunting your parasite. But it's doing so blindly. 
Without direction, your faculties could be permanently damaged. Your skull groans and bends under the pressure. <gasps> Agony. Too. You sense its hunger, its craving. It wants the tackle, but maybe something more. That's it. Ignore the pain. Think of the tadpole. Think of it purged. This torment. You. You must persist. You must be cleansed. The parasite burrows deeper, sinking its teeth into your brain's exposed tissue. It sucks greedily. You feel yourself ebbing away, while the parasite only grows stronger. It's evolving. That's it. You're almost there. The Zethis never fails. The device yearns for the creature, for every part of you tainted by its presence. You will be consumed. The tadpole quivers. Different magic is building within it. This one is ancient. Rotten. No. No more. into the tadpole's putrid magic. Its strength multiplied. It unleashes on the machine. The two forces fuse violently together, your brain their conduit. Your body and mind drift apart. You are being undone. swims back into focus. Your mind is intact, yet unfamiliar. Inside <clears throat> it, the tadpole lives on, and you feel different. No! No! The Zade Disc! What have you done? My life's work! Gone! And yet you live! And so does your parasite. Her voice cuts with a fanatical edge, an obsession bordering on mania. If there's a chance the parasite lives, she wants it. Hmm. The Zathisk must have damaged you when it was destroyed. Frustrating. I should have liked to have found out what happened. But I have no use for gibbering idiots. Leave me. No! I followed the protocol! Smoke rises like hot breath. But whatever semblance of life once powered the Zaethisk is gone. you i felt your torment someone must have tampered with it an aberrance i can't begin to comprehend there must be a charlak in this crash a traitor the sort that is hunted slaughtered and erased from our histories few would dare dishonor their queen fewer still would be so brazen now hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the Zathisk's tampering.